Well, First Tee of Fort Worth, we're one of 200 some chapters across the country. Uh, youth development through junior golf. Uh, we service uh, almost 20,000 kids here in Fort Worth annually uh, with our various programs and community outreach initiatives. And the whole idea is to teach them life skills that go far beyond the game of golf and all revolve around the First Tee's nine core values. So we're very privileged to do that and uh, we're excited to be part of this community and, and taking those kind of opportunities. I arrived in Fort Worth in 2005 and I remember having a lunch date with uh, Janet Harrell, who is chairman of the board at Shady Oaks, and we talked about this vision. And so that kind of culminated with my relationship with various people at the city and bringing about not only the driving range but the facility as well as the city put up the land. It's, it's, it is a partnership in the fact that they, they did fund, uh, donations funded, the, the, the construction of the building as well as the driving range. We have a home now. To see the looks of the children and their eyes and the families, everybody's coming to this building and all the possibilities of things that we could possibly do with the program begin to become reality. I think perhaps most importantly about this is that we can, I think this will allow us to reach even more deeply and more meaningfully into the community in a variety of ways with all the services and programs that we can provide here. There's two classrooms, or there's a large classroom that can be divided into two smaller classrooms. There's a museum, the Ben Hogan Museum, which kind of depicts golf, uh, golf in Fort Worth, gives a history of golf in Fort Worth, as well as Mr. Hogan's uh, legacy, as well as Fort Worth Junior Golf legacy. In the back of the, back of the building, there's a Henry House Hangout, which is basically the room where the kids can go, have, go relax, uh, play video games, watch TV or whatever. And I think that the, the architecture of it is wonderful with Mr. Hogan's swing progression and, and, the, and the nine core values tied into the nine panels of Mr. Hogan's golf swing. The other fabulous thing that they did with this building was the actual uh, bleachers that they created on the back side of the building that look out over the practice screen and the driving range. It's just a, f a wonderful view and a great use of space. I really didn't think I would be surprised because I had seen so many of the plans and I knew exactly what it was going to look like, but when you really get here and see it, it's an entirely different feeling. My uncle was really uh, supportive of education and he was supportive of my own education and kids in general and I think this would make him really proud and the idea that these kids will go on and, and achieve more than they might have without it is just great. I just encourage everyone uh, to get involved. Uh, this really isn't the finish line, this is really the beginning of a new race. So if this is, program is going to thrive, uh, we need uh, people to continue to invest their time and their energy and their talent and their expertise and their resources uh, so we can reach even more children in our community.